Boy, it's been a while since we talk And my head's getting nervous You don't have to work with your chest for me i have three kinds of working okay when i'm autopiloting i just work with my shoulders that is like when i am stressed i just work with my shoulders it's not like i'm working with my shoulders but i just show that the most of the energy is in my shoulders okay and this kind of tension can even give you backache my normal working is not really working with the energy in my shoulders but in my legs okay it is in my legs and normal but the mindful one that really ignites my feminine energy is when i walk with my pelvic bones not literally but then when i'm walking with the activation of my pelvic bones then everything is in the seat of my chakra okay so you are just walking and then you feel your pelvic bone moving like this you know when you're doing this kind of work you kind of feel peace in your pelvic bone it is so refreshing i'm gonna show you okay when you are working as a lady don't take short extremely short steps and don't take extremely long steps okay let it be you know in between medium okay so that when you stretch you don't feel so you know stretched in your body and when you step to it's not so short and um, you just have to focus on moving your hip bone the intention is not to let people know that you are just moving your hip bone as you the intention is for you to just enjoy yourself and also feel like you are a lady as you are doing it okay and i don't want to see you going doing this i'll show you what not to do and i'll show you what to do but if you want to know that your hip is actually moving normally you walk like this so in the course of walking just do this when you do this you just see your hip moving like that And when you want to feel if your hip is moving just hold even one hand you can feel it but when you lift two hands like this you can definitely feel it that your hip bone is just moving like this and your upper body is stable okay so this is how it looks like And you know what if you are new to this I wouldn't ask you to focus at the same time on your back your you know your posture your chin your legs your hip it's a lot for, for one day so um, you have to start with one you can first start with your posture for me my family most of us are like this we are not hunchbacks but we are like this because we tend to be on the taller side so mostly we are like this so i had to work on my posture for a long time even now i wouldn't say that i've completely got it under lock because sometimes when i sit down i realize that i tend to slouch and when my attention comes to it i just sit properly but i think now my back posture is straight compared to when i was a teenager so i had to work on that for years so um i will say that if your posture is not really aligned and straight work on that first and once you have that under lock then you come on to maybe your foot work maybe your legs just walk walk and once you have mastered your leg movements then you can bring that tension to your hip bone okay because when you take all of that at a time then it's a little bit overwhelming but once you have mastered one maybe your posture and your chin level and maybe you have mastered your legs where it is not so long of a stretch or so short of a stretch okay just 
from backwards landed on the heel resting on the foot from backwards forward landing on the heel resting on the whole foot and then you are crossing each other as you are going okay like the way cats walk usually what i do is when i was young i used to really walk on i don't know if i should say gutters or something you know the drainage system along the streets sometimes you have i don't want to say um what is it nah i don't know the word but you know the size is like this i used to walk on it like that so because of that i have a lot of scars you know and as of now i still work on it it helped me with my balance and my posture and now even if i don't have something of that sort to work on when i'm working on a normal surface in my mind that is just what i am doing but when i'm in heels i'm not gonna you know play and keep my balance and do that like children do it's a whole entire surface but in my mind it's just small okay and then i walk i walk and friends let me tell you something when you are walking on the surface of this earth you have to be confident you know why because your father owns it your father owns the earth okay and you have equal rights as anybody to walk on it to breathe to relax okay so don't be afraid to walk okay it is for your father okay the earth is for your father so step like your father owns the ground okay when i step i'm like oh my god today is a good day i am stepping like my father owns the ground because he does okay and just be in your own space you know be bigger than this world but don't be disrespectful to people and that is just what you have to do so your father owns the ground you are walking on you step step see step 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 so this is not what you should do where you walk like this okay don't work like this although i know your father owns the ground you are working on but please take it easy okay so that um when you are working nobody sees from outside that you are doing the most okay you are just working but the intention here is to enjoy it here for me i do enjoy it here oh my god if the sun is shining the air is breezy oh my goodness and i step out and i'm enjoying the movement here oh my god you can't tell me anything okay and i'm enjoying my life see 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 and naturally our hand moves as we walk to keep us balanced okay so that when you step with this foot your this your hand is not going to step on this you are not going to walk like this now that is not how god created us when you step naturally this hand flows to keep you balanced and you step this one flows to keep you balanced so your job is not to do the most with your arms okay when you step right the hand movements will just you know fall in place and as a teenager what i thought myself is when i was working my hand is not like this like a man you know this elbow this elbow i make sure that it is kind of entering my you know the space in my 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 what do you call it? my waist okay so that it falls naturally into my waist but i am not doing like this most of the time just naturally like that so when i step and then you see this um silhouette of a feminine like it, it falls like this. it doesn't fall like this it doesn't fall like this but it falls like that okay naturally so when you step it moves along with your leg in the opposite direction so Boy, it's been a while since we talked And my head's getting nervous I can handle this on and off I can't know I just gotta know where you are If I want to remain sane But you go send every text and call Oh no You could be running off with somebody else Tell me what's the hold up, baby Tell me why your phone's off Lately, I don't wanna go off Crazy, but I think I'm losing it Tell me where your heart is These days, are you being honest With me, I don't wanna go this Cray cray, but I think I'm losing it But I think I'm losing it I think I'm losing it I 
think I'm losing it by I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it by I've been staring at my phone too long Feel my eyes getting tired And the battery is long, long gone Oh no, no There is something you're not telling me But I can't wrap my head around it You said you and I were meant to be Last week You could be running off with somebody else Ooh, boy, I ask myself, yeah Boy, it's been a while since we talked And my head's getting nervous I can't handle this on and on I can't know I just gotta know where you are If I want to remain sane But you're coasting every text and call Oh no You could be running off with somebody else Ooh, boy, I ask myself Tell me what's the hold up, baby Tell me why your phone's off Lately, I don't wanna go off Crazy, but I think I'm losing it Tell me where your heart is These days, are you being honest With me, I don't wanna go this Cray cray, but I think I'm losing it But I think I'm losing it I think I'm losing it I think I'm losing it But I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it back I've been staring at my phone too long Feel my eyes getting tired And the battery is long, long gone Oh no, no There is something you're not telling me But I can't wrap my head around it You said you and I were meant to be Last week You could be running off with somebody Posture right, okay. Chin level not so high, not so up, okay. And then look straight where you are going in the direction of where you are going. It gives a sign of confidence, it doesn't give a sign of insecurity. You don't know where you are going, you are lost. Now, that is not what you should do. And then move each leg that you want to start with, but land on your heel, rest on the foot. 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 And as you are doing this, you are not going straight, but if you are crossing each other diagonally. Not so obviously, just subtle, in a subtle way. You know, you step on your heel, land on the foot, in a diagonal direction or across the other foot. Then you step on your heel, rest on the foot, across the other foot. Step on your heel, rest on the foot, across the other foot. Step on the heel, rest on the foot, across the other foot. And then let the dancing or the movements be felt in your pelvic bone, okay? When that is felt, you kind of feel like a woman, you kind of feel like a goddess. And then you just be going and your hands will follow suit, okay? So that when you are walking, people from afar don't think like you are trying to, you know, get people's attention but you're just trying to enjoy your life the most important thing is get your posture right and also whilst you're doing this smile a little bit but don't show much of your teeth you know usually this is my default b face that i have worked on over the years so that it kind of feels like you have a little bit crevice under your cheek like this but mostly your teeth is not showing so when you are like this when people um, see you you look approachable and greetable people can just say hello and pass by they can also say hello and pass by they can smile at you because your face kind of looks welcoming in a friendly good way but not attention seeker way if you know what i mean so like that and like i told you if you want to know that your hip is dancing along just do this you feel it or even just raise one hand you really feel it but when the hands are really lying down, you don't feel it, okay? So you go in like that, just do this. You, you really feel it, or even one. And as a lady, sometimes, huh, when you are walking, you have to raise this hand a little bit. That is why most of the time, 
for me i've always carried my bag in this way this is my favorite way of carrying my bag okay and ladies let me tell you a secret i've done a social experiment by myself where I wore expensive clothing, then I went out walking about anyhow with a handbag, walking like this. Like you know, I didn't have a care in the world. Like I'm squatting on this uh, like as if it, it doesn't belong to my father. And I really realized that people were kind of, you know responding in a negative way not coming to fight with me but the respect is not there and the admiration is not there and i've really worn clothing under 30 dollars or under 50 dollars and i have gone out and i've taken my time to walk like a goddess okay and i'm dressed under 30 dollars and maybe i have a shawl or something and just the walking makes people stare at me and I have also, and the other part of the experiment, I have worn expensive clothing and I have worn work anyhow. And I don't get the same respect and admiration. But when I wear tattered clothing with no tag, nothing, and I'm even wearing, you know, slides, and I'm going and I'm kind of taking my time, walking well, like my father owns the con of which I am walking, I kind of feel like people admire me, people respect me. So, what I want to say with this is it means a lot, it goes a long way, okay? Like I've been saying, smiling is the best outfit you can ever wear. So is walking and your composure and you know your demeanor. That one too goes a long way. So um yeah, that is what I have to say about this. And um I hope um you practice it and let me know how you're going about it. Let me know if it's a little bit easier for you or a little bit difficult and maybe I could you know tell you what to do I mean it takes practice okay it takes practice okay let me tell you a story ah don't name me the queen of stories growing up I grew up in a village okay and the village people were although in the village but people were enlightened so there were these twins in the village they were the daughters of the king of that village okay and they were in their prime years, maybe 20, 20 to 25 or so, or even 30. And when they step out, they take their time to walk. And by then I was young like this, I could just watch them all days. And they had heights and everything, bars, back, and they were dark. They had dark complexion and smooth. And when they would step out, this is how they walk. That is why I said I walk like your father owns the end, like their dad was the king of the village. So this is how they walk. They were about four sisters, but the twins made a huge impression on me. And the other lady, she just walked anyhow. But the twins, I don't know. This is how they walked. They were a little bit of pompous, I should say, okay, but it was nice. That is not what I'm telling you to go and do, okay? Just walk and enjoy it and carry yourself. Don't let your body carry you, okay? Hold yourself together, please. Don't let your body carry you. Carry your body, okay? So, I guess I'm done for the day. Boy, it's been a while since we talked. And my head's getting nervous I can't handle this on and off I can't know I just gotta know where you are If I want to remain sane But you're ghosting every text and call Oh no You could be running off with somebody else Sky.